Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. Um, we just got the spear for that girl and her dad, so we need to go run it back to her and hopefully they'll be grateful. And then I believe we need to meet up with Rost, um, because we crafted those fire arrows he said we needed for the final test. So we're gonna go ahead and run over here to this marker. No one else around. Looks safe to meet. My guess is he'll be waiting for me. Who? If I go to... If I go to my map... Let's see, what is this? Talk to Karst and trade for the Tripcaster. Okay, we might as well do that while we're here. There he is. Looks nervous. Hey, Karst. Well, well, well. An outcast on my doorstep. All mother protect me. Surprised you saw me the way you keep looking every other direction to make sure no one's watching. Careful there, or you'll sprain your neck. This guy's it's a little bit a shady. pain in the neck when you show up, girl, one way or another. <laughs> okay, we could talk. tell him to stop acting like a chuff. What is a chuff? Is there a reason why you're acting so cranky today? Once you run the proving and get made a brave, you'll deal with traitors in mother's heart. Maybe I don't like losing customers. Traitors who don't break the law and deal with outcasts, you mean? That's right. Our days of crime will be behind us, so long as you keep quiet. Are you worried I'm going to tell someone that you trade with outcasts? I don't think you're the kind who talks, but you never know. You can stop worrying. The secret's safe with me. Yeah, that's what I figured. But I don't mind hearing it. All right, Ross knows what. Why do you take the risk, trading with outcasts? Every time you ask. If a big, meaningful talk is what you're after, move along. It's because you used to be one, isn't it? Yeah. Got caught poking around one of the metal ruins out beyond the embrace. Matriarch said I was tainted and gave me five years. What did you see in the ruins? Nothing I can make sense of. After my shunning, I tried living back in Mother's heart, but everyone I knew had moved on, and there were so many people everywhere I turned. I like it better out here. This guy's got an interesting backstory. The only person I've ever told about our trades is Rost. Yeah, well, not like he can turn me in, even if he wanted to. Law and duty sort of a man, that Rost. I don't know how you stand it. You really don't know why he was cast out? I've told you no. I don't think anyone knows what he did, but it must have been serious because his term is for life. He must feel that he deserves it, which is why he's such a rule follower. Or maybe he was an outcast just to take care of us. Last time I visited, you had a tripcaster available for trade. Still got it? I do. But you'd need to bring me a scrapper lens. What can I say? Special weapons don't come cheap. Do I already have one of those? Oh, I can pay. Took down a scrapper not long ago. Stripped out the lens in perfect condition. I'll be the judge of that. Show me. Alright, tripcaster. Cost is one scrapper lens. All right, this weapon creates traps which detonate when the tripwire connecting two anchor points is broken. Okay, so it creates a tripwire. <clears throat> it is best used to cross enemy patrol paths or in narrow spaces can be modified. All right, interesting. Is this uh, one use or is this multiple use? No, it's a weapon that creates traps. Okay, so it can create multiple traps. It says ammo, 160 thunderbolts. I don't know what that means, but let's go ahead and let's buy this. Okay, uh, do we want to equip it? Sure. Let's go ahead and put our tripcaster here in the bottom slot. Um, we can buy a sling. 
The slow firing sling lobs elemental bombs with a large area effect. Best used to inflict elemental states on targets. Okay, so this does like AoE elemental damage, making them vulnerable to follow up attacks. Okay, interesting. We do not have the 70 metal shards needed. A rope caster. This weapon is used to tie down machines and immobilize them. Larger targets will require more ropes, and attacking a tied machine will reduce the immobilization time. Can be modified. Okay, so this is not really useful for necessarily offense, but this can basically let us like single out individual targets by roping some of them down so we don't have to worry about them. What is a war bow? This low damage weapon fires elemental payloads best used to put targets in vulnerable states, providing valuable combat advantage. Fires elemental payloads. Isn't that what we're using right now? What's the difference? I think we already have a war bow. Sharp shot bow. This slow firing but highly accurate bow is best used for long range combat when target precision is critical. Okay, so this is like a sniper kind of bow. And this is low damage when I'm guessing it fires really fast. Um, and this is a different kind of sling. This slow firing sling logs at elemental bombs. Okay, this is the same kind of description that they give for this other sling. What's the difference? This one has a different kind of ammo. It looks like you can use this like starry ammo or this electrical ammo. This one just uses the starry ammo. Okay, interesting. We can't afford any of this stuff, but it's good to know that if we want, we can come get stuff from Karst. Blaze. Okay. Traps and potions. I don't think I'm going to buy any of this stuff until I kind of figure out how this game works a little better and we kind of figure out what we want to get. So, we're going to go back. Now that you've got Thank yourself you. a trip caster, practice how to use it someplace else, all right? My life's exciting enough without a bunch of shock wire booby traps to trip over. Really? Could have fooled me. <laughs> Has he got a quest for me? Will you be around later in case I want to make another trade? I'll be here. Same as usual, bring me the parts you harvest from any machines you hunt. The better the parts, the more shards I'll pay. Be sure to take a close look at my inventory, though. Who knows? Maybe I've got something that could give you an edge in the proving. All right. Good to know. I guess Once we collect more business. parts, we'll come back. We all can't right. really afford anything Good right now. It sounds like we need a lot more metal Blessing shards. Of all mother and all that. I've got what I need. Time to meet Rost at the North Gate. Okay, press enter to open the quest menu. Um, let's see. Active. Okay, so we have the main quest, which we're going to put uh, to the side. Let's look at side quests. Yeah, we need to return to Thok. This is the one that we want to do. Let's go ahead and click F to activate quest. And next we'll do this talk to Grata, okay? All right. To equip the trip caster, bring up the weapon wheel and select default ammunition with craft pouch upgrade available. Okay, we have four ammunition already. Pouch upgrade available. Aim at the ground near an enemy and fire two spots to place the shock wire. It will stun an enemy that crosses the wire. Okay, so this is like a stun gun. Keep that for later. Okay, I'm gonna just have my bow equipped by default because I want to be ready for anything and we'll use the trip caster when it's appropriate. We'll gather some more medicine because we really took a, quite the beating at the end of the last episode in that fight. Where did that boar go? We scared it away. I don't think we're going to be able to hit it from here. Though... 
I do see. Let's see if we can do some sniping. He moved away. It's gonna be hard to snipe him from here. It's getting closer. We'll, we'll try out our chip caster in a second too. But I need I wanna get some more metal shards. Now we know we can buy stuff with it. Maybe I can attack one of these horse things. not go as smoothly as planned, but we survived. Oh, is there another one? Fantastic. Expertly dispatched. Alright, let's get all of the resources we can from these. Let's scan the area so we can see harvestable uh, corpses. Okay, we can probably stop crouching. Okay, shards, a strider heart, blaze and sparker. Okay, search this watcher, more shards. Okay, and we should probably be collecting uh, Ridgewood as often as we can. Uh, I need to remember, I think it was Q, yeah. Let's go ahead and heal up. Stop, are you here? Mother's watch is this way. Okay, I see wildlife. Fantastic. We'll go ahead and collect our collect our prize. Because I think we're gonna have to give this meat to that woman, that other outcast. I wonder what happens if we walk into Mother's heart. We probably shouldn't, shouldn't. It wouldn't be appropriate. I worry they might start attacking us. Okay, we ran out of ammo. That'll keep my stomach. So we're gonna have to go ahead and craft some more. Fantastic. Alright, hello. Oh, mother be praised. Aloy's back with the spear. Here they are. Hi. We got your your wife's spear. First you send a Rana back to me, and now you've got the spear. When I first called out to you for help, I didn't even know if you'd speak to me. I'm glad you did. I'll teach me you. Me too. Be nice to outcast. I can't believe you got the spear back. Your mother knew how to craft them. It's of exceptional make. I'll never be the crafter she was, but she did pass along a few tricks. I'd be happy to take a look at your spear. Thank you. It sounds like she was special. I'm sorry for your loss. Well, because of you, I still have the spear to remember her by. You didn't have to help us, but you did. She would have admired that. Thank you, Aloy, for everything. Anytime. Did we get a spear upgrade? 
spirit damage boost. Interesting. I wonder if there's a way to be upgrading our gear. If I, so if I go into our menu by pressing enter, we go into crafting, modify weapons. Uh, let's look at our Karja Hunter bow. This lightweight bow trades power for faster reload and firing time and is good for short to medium range combat. Okay, so this uses fire arrows or normal arrows, and apparently it's just really fast. Handling must be speed. Has 80 handling, and we have two possible modifications. How do I make a modification? How do I make a modification? Let's see, a damage coil. Uncommon, 17% damage, 9% tear, 6% corruption. Modification will be lost. If you equip a mod in a full slot, the old mod will be lost. Okay. So I have a damage coil and a 5% damage coil. This is probably not that good, but the 17% damage coil is good. Let's just equip this one and we're gonna leave the other slot open for um, any other modifications we might find along the road. I don't know where to get modifications. Okay, doesn't look like I have anything here. So we're gonna go back. What about outfits? What are we wearing? Looks like we don't have any outfits. All right, ammo, travel, traps and potions. Herbal remedies used for healing. So if we get different kinds of meat, we can create different potions. Restores 150 health, a brew made from animal extract, restoring and healing when consumed. Let's craft some health potions. I don't know how we use potions, but it might be worth it. And I think after we, we leveled up our character in the last episode, we died and we never leveled up again. So let's go ahead and let's, uh, let's take some of those perks again. Um, so let's see. Silent takedowns. Yes, this was one of the skills that we definitely want. Press left click to perform silent takedown on small machines. Okay, so left click is our silent takedown. What is this? Left click to silently drop. You know, I think I like the stealth, so we're going to take this as well. Um, and I have one more skill. So do these cost two? Okay, I should be aware of that. Time slows while aiming during a jump or a slide. Landing from a fall or jump is completely silent and will not alert. Okay, I think this is also going to be worth for a stealth kind of a stealth themed playthrough. All right. So we've upgraded ourselves. We've got inventory. Spear. This uh, melee weapon has a quick light attack and a slower heavy attack. They both say left click. Oh, but one of them is shift left click. All right, the blade has been sharpened for additional damage thanks to that quest. Okay, fantastic. Okay, um, we could probably spend all day looking through our inventory and uh, I'd rather just kind of more organically um, discover, you know, our inventory and how this game works. I'll tuck that away. All right, um, but we do need to go into our quests. We finished all of our side quests, but we do need to talk to old Grata. So I'm going to go ahead and press F to activate this quest, and we're going to see where the marker leads us. Apparently, she's all the way up there. All right, that's going to be a bit of a hike. We should save. I need to get used to the fact that this game doesn't let you save wherever. We have to save at specified times, specified places. Okay, I wonder if we go left and around or right and around to get there. I think left is the way. This is a really steep path. It's a good thing Aloy is so athletic. 
Grata, are you home? Could be anything in the trees. You're sharp, Eloy. Could be anything in the trees. You did not speak. Why did we take out our bow? Why is it electrified? I know. Even when my belly and hands are empty, that you hold me in your embrace. Hello, Grata. Oh, mother. I think she's gonna ignore us. Out. That's what Ross said. Have I not been constant as the river flows? Have I not kept the vows as the stones do? Show me your grace, all oh mother, and provide for me once more. Good news, Grata. Once again, All Mother has brought you rabbits. All Mother, your voice cracks like the distant thunder. I hear the songs of grief, All Mother. Man, she could at I least show us a little call, gratitude. But I left my prayer beads atop the eastern overlook. I am afraid. Wait at your camp for me, Grata. I'll see what I can do. Pod Grata, go to Overlook Climb. All right. Then off we go, running more errands for her, even though she won't talk directly to us. But it seems like she kind of found a loophole. She's praying and giving us information as she prays. Look out below! I know, we're a menace. All right, where is Overlook Climb? Apparently very far away. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and save again. You can never be uh, saving too often. Until we can afford some more powerful weapons, I think we're gonna be dying a lot in this game. Speaking of... Let's try to get this uh, canister on this back. Keep the upper hand. Okay. We're hiding and they can't see us. Ah, uh, this was a mistake. Okay, so we're dealing more damage with our spear though. Okay, we're gonna run out of ammo if we're not careful. I need to remember that dodging is an option. I just need to remember actually how to do that. Obtain two metal shards. Obtain two sparkers. 25. Okay. Fantastic. Okay. We keep taking damage in these Got combats, one. so we need to keep healing. It's not too bad right now, but I should sure I I should certainly think about being more careful in the future. Okay, we'll go ahead and save. The brave trail at the rocks is close by. Oh boy. We're just gonna casually back off. We're gonna sneak into this tall grass here. Oh, uh, we might be 
dead. I think there was a way to uh, dodge. I don't remember exactly what the button is. I need to go look in the controls menu to get it. We've dispatched them. I said I wanted to go for stealth, and here I am, completely failing at all measures of stealth whatsoever. I think I need to get better at aiming my shots. Like, I know where to hit these guys to one-shot them. And, uh, if I one-shot them, then I don't have to worry Stopping. about stealth. Ah. This is lovely weather. I'm gonna go ahead and craft some more arrows while we're at it. Gotta maybe devout, but it takes strong arms to reach the upper with the fast way. Okay. Let's remind ourselves why we're going to this overlook. So if I go to quests, old grata. The old outcast old Grata often needs help to survive in the wild. The trouble is she'll only speak to those praying to the goddess all mother, so understanding what she want isn't easy. Okay. They don't actually give us any more information than that. They don't give us updated information. Um is this a run and a jump thing? There we go. Okay. Now what? Okay, we can kind of sidestep. Wow. Okay, I am endlessly impressed by Aloy's ability to climb. I wish I could climb like that. No wonder she needed us to come up here. I cannot imagine her doing this. But where do we go from here? Wow. Okay. Okay, we're gonna keep climbing up, and up, and over. Alright. We've just about made it. Just down there? Wow, that's fun. Can we shoot those guys? Nah. Let's leave the birds alone. Is this where the beginning of the game? Where we got this name? Supplies for Grata. Her prayer beads. Aha! Uh -huh. Grata's prayer beads. I see why she comes up here to pray. It looks out to Mother's Gate. You know, I wonder what bothers me more. That she ignores me, and that with all her talking to all mothers, she's never lonely. What are they hunting out there? Beyond the embrace. Can't be just one machine. Beyond the embrace. That might be where we're going after this. Alright, let's go ahead and repel down. Whoa. Okay, that's not how I would have chosen to repel down. Halo likes danger, it seems. Okay, this driving a bit. Strider site around here, apparently. Okay, we're gonna enter the tall grass, and we're gonna see what we can do. I need to take care of the watchers first. This guy is isolated and all alone out there. Okay, that didn't even alert any of the others. Okay, 
That was a much cleaner dispatch. Okay, we need to make all of our combats like that. Are we still... Are we still in combat? Oh, I see. There's something far away that sees us. I don't think we can snipe it from here. Okay, let's go ahead and take these resources. I need to remember that I have these rocks to throw as well. Yes. Okay, that's a really useful tool in our arsenal that we shouldn't be neglecting. Being able to distract those watchers is going to be really good. Inventory is full for rocks at least. Okay. Helpful. Ow. Well, preferably next time not not dodging straight into the charging beast. But yes, we get the point. I thought these striders, their whole thing is that that they uh, they scare easily. They seem very aggressive. Instead of just scaring off, they're they're running at us. Okay. We are gonna leave them be. Actually, we don't need to kill all the striders in the area. Just need to make sure we've looted everybody here. Which I think we have. Okay. Onwards. We're meeting Grata back at her camp. We're gonna give her her prayer beads. And she's gonna be very grateful. That's a joke. She's not gonna say anything. Not even a simple thank you. Okay, we need to continue gathering medicine. Get it while I can. I am getting damaged left, right, and center. Those guys are right where we left them. I would think they would have gone to get help by now. Maybe they're just having fun watching us run around, making a fool of ourselves. Wax root. So I was talking to one of my buddies who plays this game. Um, and he actually says there's a big variety of like combat strategies that you can opt for in this game. Um, and a lot of different weapons and play styles. So I don't think we need to feel stuck in with this bow and spear thing that we have going. Um, once we get some more money and the next there's time Grata. we talk to Kro Karst, call, the I think his name is Karst. We can try to trade for some more interesting weapons and just try out some different things until we find something we're really happy with. Here are your with. prayer beads, Grata. Now you have what you need. All oh, mother. Each morning I find your tears of joy speckling the leaves. Joy at the beauty of all you have made. See how I cry now with you in gratitude. So you'll cry for her, but she won't speak to me. Fine. Guess that makes you the better outcast. Grata, I may not be around much for a while. I'm gonna run in the proving, and I'm not sure what's gonna happen after that. Oh, Mother, I thank you for the kindnesses you share. When the proving comes, in your great wisdom, 
May you give favor to a brave of generous heart. I think I get what you're saying. Goodbye, Grata. For now. We'll take it. Hear me as I right. count off my I think we have devotion. significantly more um, metal shards than we did last time we went to go see Karth. So let's see if we can uh, buy any new weapons. Hunt down any uh, striders while we're at it. Any more striders or watchers or what were those other thing called? Scrappers. Those are the really dangerous ones. They don't seem to have any weak point those scrappers. Study is a drum beat. All right, let's go down the interesting way. Yeah. All right, we're meeting Rost. I'll find a use for you. Or perhaps not. I said we should try to go see cars. Let's let's go do that. What's this exclamation mark? I should probably go there too. Is there a sign for for the trader? Merchant. Hunting goods. Here. Okay, I'm gonna put a little marker there. That's far out of our way. Do we actually wanna do that? Maybe not. Maybe we can just wait and buy some stuff later. Um, let's go to this exclamation mark though. I wanna see what that is. Perhaps it's a new quest. And um, once we find out what this is, that will probably be a good stopping point for the episode. It's your sister, Olara! Uh oh. What's going on? How do I climb up there? She seems to be worried for her children. Or her sister. No, she said it's her sister. Oh, wait. This game could be a little more obvious with its climbing. Sometimes it's hard to see where to go. Especially when it's Rom, raining out. can you hear me? Hello, are, are you willing to talk to us? We can help. But only if you Who tell us what's you going on. Who are you calling out for? Do you need help? I have nothing against outcasts, far from it. But I shouldn't talk to you, I don't want to get in trouble. I don't see anyone else around to help. I guess you're right. I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to be callous. My brother was cast out, but his sentence has ended. He, he should have come home, but he didn't, and, and his camp was covered in blood. You, um... You said your brother's camp was soaked with blood? Uh-oh. The Braves He's probably died. Heaven, and that's what they found. All I can think about is what might have happened. Is he really dead? Or maybe just wounded? Is he suffering? Does he need help? I can't stand it not knowing. In your dreams, he's he's just wounded. The curious in me wants to know, but I'm worried that she's going to ask it in the wrong way. Please ask this in a sensitive and nice way. Why was your brother cast out? Rom was always a little different. A little touched. One of the hunters had a cruel heart and never let him alone. I was gone but an hour, and the hunter said after him like always, but this time, Rom struck back with a rock and split the man's skull. He's a murderer. Spirits made him do it, he said. Whispers of the forgotten. It cost him ten years. I never should have left him alone. What are you what doing are you out doing here out alone? Here? Each day I cut a notch on the wall so I knew Brahm's sentence was over. Then I cut three more. But he still hadn't come back. Maybe he wasn't cutting notches on the walls. I begged the matriarchs to send braves to find him and all they found was a blood-soaked camp. The braves said he must be dead. But I have to know the truth. So I came out looking for him. All right. What do you mean forgotten? All mother curses, blasphemers who won't repent. 
banishing them from her eternal memory. Those lost spirits are the forgotten. Brom used to say they spoke to him, told him to do things. It was such a burden for him, and, and there was nothing I could do to help. Possessed. That's interesting. Okay, we'll go look for I'll him. I'll do what I can to find your brother. You will? Then let me come with you. I won't be a bother. I know how to stay out of sight. I'm faster on my own. If that is how it must be, just find him then. Please. All right. And that is an adventure for the next episode. We are going to find this woman's brother. Probably dead, but maybe alive. And then we're going to go meet Rost and uh, see what he wants us to do with those fire arrows. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.